cases have, hadn't changed that much. The, you know, the numbers I showed you, we um, barely went up. Um, uh, I don't know what I'm seeing here. The, you know, the numbers barely went up, and you can see that um, hospitalizations just ticked up a small amount. So no, not really that. Not I was a little surprised, but uh, really I was more surprised a few weeks ago when it went down from high to low. Not sure other than, you know, I know that hospital capacity is a part of it. You know, us for South County with two hospital systems being a catchment area for uh, other um, counties, I think could affect it. Also, you know, our population here has more access to testing with more providers, uh, just more locations where testing is available. So if you live in Forsyth County, you know, you're just, the geography puts you closer to get tested. So you're probably more likely to get tested versus in a more rural county. So I think it's just a multitude of factors. I think the biggest thing with, with COVID, like we've said all along, it's not going to be an on off switch and it's still out there. So we still have to take uh, precautions and really the biggest precaution not even to get into the mass debate is uh, I would say the biggest thing is vaccine, 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 and make sure you stay up to date on your vaccines. Yeah, yeah, I think that's, um, yeah, I think it's, too, it's premature for that. And again, like I said, when I look at the numbers, I'm just looking on the chart since early to mid-May, it stayed pretty constant in that seven to 800, maybe dipped into the 600s. So, um, you know, we're well well after Memorial Day. So looks like we saw a little bit of a rise then. Um, well, it'll probably be a little bit to know about July 4th, but uh, you know, a lot of those activities are outdoors, so um, less risky. Uh, but I think, you know, as we come into, you know, we're in that real, we're in summer, it's hot. So people are, more people are inside. Uh, you know, you're gonna be around, you be in a lot of places where people, um, you know, when, when we were all wearing masks, or the majority of us, you obviously had, you know, masks protect you. So 18 months ago, when you went somewhere, 95% of people were wearing masks, we were protecting each other. Obviously, we don't have that. I don't think we need to go back to that. But I'm just saying, it's even more important that you have the vaccine uh, to have that protection. So if you do have a case, it'll hopefully, um, COVID, it'll be mild. And we hope in the fall we have a booster that's like with the Omicron, with the BA5 variants. So we're uh, have that added protection.